Did Elizabeth I and Robert Dudley ever sleep together? Although Elizabeth has gone down in history as being known as the Virgin Queen, it is also known that Elizabeth loved one man above all others, and that was Robert Dudley, the first Earl of Leicester. Robert Dudley was considered an absolute bay at the Elizabethan court. He was nearly six feet tall, which was very tall for the time. He also had a great physique. He was very healthy, athletic. He was also cultivated, witty and charming. And basically all the women at Elizabeth's court would swoon for him because he was hot. However, Elizabeth and Robert had history. They had known each other for some time before Elizabeth became queen. They had been childhood friends, and then in 1554, they had both been imprisoned in the Tower of London at the same time. And so in 1558, when she became queen, Elizabeth showered him with many, many favours. He became her master of the horse, which was an important position within court, and ensured that he was always close to her. The following year, he was elected a Knight of the Garter, another great mark of respect. In that same year, a contemporary said this of him, Lord Robert has come so much into favour that he does whatever he likes with affairs, and it is even said that Her Majesty visits him in his chamber day and night. People talk of this so freely that they go so far as to say that his wife has a malady in one of her breasts and the Queen is only waiting for her to die to marry Lord Robert. So this contemporary was referring to the fact that Robert already had a wife, Amy Robstart, and that they were waiting for her to die of some disease so that Robert and Elizabeth could marry because apparently they were already enjoying each other in the bedroom. By the way, I have covered this subject and the whole life of Elizabeth I in my latest series, so please do go check it out. It is also said that the couple, that's Robert and Elizabeth, loved to dance together and that they would play the Volta. This was a very fast-paced, almost erotic dance in which men had to lift up their partners into the air, which required lots of touching. The fact that the Queen did this dance so openly with one of her favourites only fuels speculation that they were lovers. However, I think although Elizabeth was sorely tempted by Robert, and in an ordinary world in which she wasn't Queen, I think they would have married. However, because she knew that her position was so precarious and that she could not marry because she would have to relinquish her control, I don't think she ever dared to actually sleep with Robert.